So I was sitting in the doctor chair because I was about to donate blood because I do that. And I was thinking, ugh, the next video is like six minutes long. That's twice as long as my other videos. I need to come up with a super short video to keep my viewers quen. So I was sitting in the recovery room eating my pretzels. You know, okay, what happened to the good food you'd get when you donated blood? I remember a year ago when I started donating, they had fruit snacks and double stuffed Oreos and apple juice. Now it's like, here's some water and some pretzels. You're a real hero, you know? Like that was one of the main reasons I donated blood. Oh, you saved so many lives, thank you. Yeah, 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 just give me my Oreos. Like if I was roommates with Dracula and he offered to cook me a meal, like a good tasting meal for a cup of my blood, blood, I would accept it in a heartbeat. <laughs> I mean, not every day, obviously. Maybe like every Friday. So this happened. So this all happened about an hour ago. Well, probably like two days ago when this video comes out. And if you're watching it a year from now, it happened about a year ago. So sorry if I don't sound as animated as usual. So it is entirely possible that someone watching this has my blood in them. And I think that makes us related by blood. So I got into the blood donation business because my dad could, because my dad has O negative blood, which is the universal donor blood. They keep O negative blood on ambulances because O negative can give to everyone. There's no blood tests needed. But I'm O positive, which is the most common blood type. So I'm not special. One time when I was in one time I was in a child development class and I don't know how the topic came up, but my table started talking about blood types. And I said, oh, I'm O positive. And this girl across from me says, oh, I forget mine, but my doctor said I'm the universal donor. And I said, oh, that means you're O negative. And then the teacher walks by and is like, oh, you're talking about blood types? What are what are you, uh girl? And she says, O neg. She said, oh, neg. Like so many people have asked her what her blood type is and she didn't want to waste her time any more than she had to by saying a tiv. You didn't even know what your blood type was until I said it. And then I don't remember why, but she got her donor card out of her purse and it says what blood type you have. And she says, huh, on here it says I have O positive. Hmm. So I guess O positive is the universal donor. And you know those moments where you want to argue with someone because you're so obviously right, but you just don't care enough and you don't want to talk to the person any longer than you have to? You know those moments? So I go, oh, yeah, I guess you're right. 